Hey guys, it's me, Becky. And when you see this container, you know it's time for me to do a sneaky secret giveaway. Um, I also have a, a book I want to share with y'all here in a minute. Um, I stayed home from work today so I could um, get my blood pressure and blood sugar under control, I hope. And um, we'll see how it goes. But I wanted to do this while I'm home. Might as well. And what I did is in here are the names that left three or more comments in the last six days. All right. So if you've been visiting and leaving comments in the last week, basically, and you left more than three, three or more, your name is in here to win that box of goodies I've been putting together over there on the table. So we'll see. Spin it around and look the other way and dig through and pull out one. So here's one. And the winner is Kendra. Kendra, you win the box of goodies I've been putting together. Yay, Kendra. Um, Kendra's a sweet gal. Um, you'll have to go over her. I think she goes with by her name. No, she doesn't. It's a crazy crafter. And um, she uses her last name in crazy. So um, I'll put a link to Kendra's channel below in the description box. And I hope y'all will go check her out. And congrats, Kendra. Awesome. All right, I'm going to set that over there. Now, Scott found this book on the Internet. And it's Eat Well on $4 a Day, Good and Cheap by Leanne Brown. Now, when you purchase this book, she gives one of these books to a lower income family in the need of learning to eat on less money per day. Um, and I thought that was a really, really good um, thing for her to do. And it's got some really yummy recipes. I don't want to share them on camera because she went to all the work to... Um, put this cookbook together but I know Esther you're watching your pennies as much as we are here and um, it's like $16 or something but you're also basically buying a cookbook for somebody else so if you think about it that way you're gifting to someone you're paying it forward by purchasing this book that makes me feel good um, we are enjoying this cookbook. I will let you know how we try some of the recipes as we go along. Um, the only thing with my sugar out, I'm kind of wishing she had a um, carb counter. She tells you how much the total cost and how much it costs per serving on each recipe. But um, I just, I, I really wish that had been added in there, especially right now. So, but anyway. I will let you peek at the front because I'm sure they have a peek on Amazon. Um, it's, she's got tips for shopping well. Um, how to save money by buying in bulk. Strategies for when you go in the supermarket. Um, a list of groceries you won't regret buying. Uh, there's a seasonal chart in it so you can eat seasonally. And that'll save you a lot of money because when things are in season, the price goes down, okay? Utilizing your leftovers and then just basic kitchen equipment. This would make an awesome wedding gift for somebody, too, just starting out. You know how we all struggled when we first got married, you know? It, it's not easy, and then you start having kids, and that makes it, you know, tighter. So, anyway, this is non-crafty, but I thought I would share it because we're tickled to death with it and her cause of helping other families so I guess that's about it although I do want to let Laura know that I was naughty and I ordered the complete set of diamond dies for last month um yeah that'll learn them to tell me I have to stay home today <laughs> I'm so looking forward to getting them though because this whole set with the sand buckets and the the sunfish, starfish, and the little fish, and the sea. Oh, it's a beautiful set. Um, I have not regretted purchasing the leaf dye either. 
and I can't wait to dig out some vellum. I'm going to try to cut some vellum leaves with the, the leaf that's lacy that I got separately because um, I think it would be really awesome. I might do a video on um, die cutting those out and working with them with the, um, what are they called, embossing tools. All right, I'll let you guys go. I need to uh, rest a minute, and I'll talk to you all later. Bye.